In this video, I want to go over a little Pinterest-like WordPress theme that I call Pinstrap WP. It's a pretty cool little theme that looks like Pinterest, acts like Pinterest, and has some cool features like infinity scroll and some other little options. So here's a little demo. Uh, you click, go to the site, and you can see as you scroll down, it loads more posts. So it just can continue to go down as you scroll. So then if you click into an image, you can see it takes you to the single post, but I also have some options in the background in the dashboard that you can set to make it open in a light box. So let me show you some of the customization settings. So I'm going to go over here and I'll show you how you do it from the dashboard. So you go to appearance, customize, and then we have this settings area right here. And then we have some settings for this theme. So this first one here is post per row. Right now I have it set to six and you can change it to whatever you'd like. So let's, for example, change it to two, save that. And you can see here, if you reload the front end of the site, it goes to two post. So you'd have to have some pretty big images if you wanted to do that. Here's an example of four. Looks pretty cool. And then notice as you scroll, it's already loading post as you go which is really nice. All right, and the next option here is the light box. Uh, see, I have it disabled. I'm gonna go ahead and change this back to six and enable this light box. Save and publish that. And then we'll reload the front end again. And then this just gives you the option where the user can actually click into the actual post. So they just click and they just see the image real big instead of actually going to read about the post. So if you want the user to read about the image or about the post that you're doing, of course you'd want to disable that light box. So the next option we have here is the show hide author, which is right here. So you can hide that. For example, if you only have one author on the site, you know, you may not want to show the same author over and over again with the same image. So we can save that. And then the last one here is the tags. So I'm gonna go in here, oh, go in here, um, go to post, and I'll just edit one of these posts and throw a tag in here. Save that, upload or update. Reload the front end here. You can see I'm there's these big edit buttons for if you're signed in as a, an author of the site or an admin of the site. But if you're not, you can click in here. You can see down here at the bottom, we have this tag area. So from again, appearance, customize in the settings, you can disable that tag, save it, reload the front end again. And you can see that tag went away. So this theme has some pretty cool options. You know, you can go to the categories and you, it's already displayed by the category, whatever it's set for each post. We also have a custom menu up here and there's also a site identity and you can change the logo pretty easily from the dashboard. One last option I wanna go over here is this search feature. So you can, you know, search for every, anything that you want on the site and then it comes up and displays exactly how you would expect. So yeah, that's a pretty quick little demo of Pinstrap, uh, the Pinterest-like WordPress theme that has infinity scroll. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out.